Hey guys, so I'm doing my video from outside <laughs> my room today and I've had great feedback from my ukulele playing so I'm gonna play some more ukulele. I just, I only know like, well four chords, I know actually four, five chords, five chords, six I don't know, five or six chords now. I can play the uh, Maroon 5 payphone song, well, kind of. Um, it takes a while to kind of get into it though. Uh, let me think. Um. tried to sing to the music as well but I'm not really there yet I mean I love to sing but I don't think I can sing and play the tune at the same time I've tried and it's a bit of a disaster so um, actually Hugo I met in Sabah in KK he said that he really enjoys the ukulele playing so this is mainly for you Hugo because I'm not really sure who else is really interested but I'll just play some tunes like I just kind of mess around a bit just playing the same four chords so and you're right it does sound happy it makes me think of Hawaii not that I've ever been today I just took lots of pictures or like a few pictures I met up with my friend Patrick who I met in Chiang Mai last year and that was nice we went to Rasayana and then I met another guy called David who's from England he's from Ipswich and 
we were in Barcelona for quite a few hours and then Patrick decided that he was going to go to the train station to see um, see what time the train leaves and whether he could get on one and he's gone now, he's gone on the train so we cycled there from Rasayana and wow the traffic was just jam packed it was like it was so hot as well the sun was really strong and um, yeah it was crazy cycling through Bangkok and then we got to the train station he bought his ticket and then we went in search of some food we went for fruit I wanted some juice some fresh juice so I ended up buying pomegranate juice orange juice and mango juice and I also bought mangoes guava some pineapple and I had to fix my puncture but luckily Patrick was there and like it was kind of like teamwork but he did most of it <laughs> and yeah then on the way back from the train station I, I had these bottles and this food with me and the bags gave way on separate occasions first it was the bottles and then it was the fruit so i lost quite a lot of the stuff that i had never mind but yeah it's been a good day it's been a really good day actually i really enjoyed spending time with patrick and kind of makes me want to go to chiang mai and spend time with some other fruity people but i don't know what i'm gonna do i'm here till saturday um i don't know if i'll stay longer or if i'll go live in the countryside because I think I need to get out of the city, out of the pollution and yeah I don't know what's going to happen but if you like to see me play the ukulele then give this video a thumbs up, um, put your requests down below if you want me to learn a particular song I will have a look. Um, I think I may look into buying one because I don't think I can take this with me. <laughs> I might ask if I can like buy it off them, I don't know. <laughs> um, but I cycled past the shop today so I might go and see how much they are. And um, yeah, I think I'm going to fill my days with ukulele playing, meditation and what was the other one? Um, you can learn the meditation, oh, and reading, and maybe do some cycling as well. <laughs> so, yeah, um, I hope you've enjoyed listening to what I've been up to. And tomorrow, I'm not too sure what I'm going to do. I think maybe just spend the day in Rasayana. And <laughs> that's pretty much all I do. So don't forget to check my Instagram page for pictures. Check out my daily blog, which, you know, sometimes I don't post, but... <laughs> Um, yeah, just check it out, check out my social media, brawls and bananas, and yeah, thanks for watching, and see you tomorrow maybe.